everybody and welcome to another episode of our family escape today we are in grand's pen and bull bay look at that ocean behind me jess is here mommy is here enzo is here papi tau the entire family we actually came here last sunday and we had a wonderful time i actually vlogged the entire thing so this is what we did check it out Ashanti, long time no see. How are you? Yes, we haven't been here in ages. You going to backflip? You're flipping? Shall we used to go and when we did go we were coming back but we turned somewhere and then we found this beach do you remember how long ago it was it was like a, a year about a year ago a year ago yeah and you made some friends here yeah ashanti 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 was doing back flips and no but not back flip he, he's ba he, he's, he's bad, bad at it now bad at it now. Out when yeah he does, and he does he does the front flip that I do fall down on my back and chain that cooks the fish for us is gonna be cooking some fish for us too yeah. today. Yeah. The first time we came here, we made a friend. That's how nice this this all place is. And, but it has been a long time since we have come here and everything it's still nice so right now we're gonna go for a swim i have never looked under these waters before i have my goggles with me my fins the boys carry theirs too but i have cows so i can get really crazy with the snorkeling but i'm very excited to take a look under and see what's there so let's go
interesting. You know, it, it always amazes me how we can be going to the same beach for years and have no idea what lays below. Justice. and what were the odds that we would find these right there on the coral? So the fish is ready, Sab, Papa and Tao are there eating so we're gonna join them. Yum yum! <laughs> so good the bok bok fish tastes so good look at this meat look at that i'm telling you you guys are married to snapper and fart and you're missing out big how tough the skin is mm -hmm. so it is still a vertebrate vertebrate are things that have that have um backbones. backbones and you can see that the buck buck has a backbone right here following all the way to his head wow amazing fish huh so if there's no it is delicious Because they won't get in the water unless I go for them. So let's go. 
We just keep trying. Alright, let's come out then. We had a lot of fun swimming. You're not swimming today? Yeah. No? You're enjoying the beach though? In your shoes and socks? We are now heading to one of my favorite parts of Grand Stand. It is a section that it's very well. Let me show you. <laughs> It just, I love how it changes. You have the trees and these huge rocks that just give you that Europe feel. <laughs> but I think it's a great opportunity to remind you all to say no to plastics. Whenever you're buying your drinks, when you go to the shop, try to ask for a glass container instead. Plastic. Yeah, or a paper one. Or a paper one, because although the paper one is still there, with time, 
it will degrade and, and just become nothing. And these ones, they turn into tiny little micro balls and, they, and sometimes they go into the water and just like how all the, um, um, all the sea creatures can see plankton, they'll see those balls and they'll eat them. They will eat them. And they also get integrated with the coral and the coral is... Oh, we're interrupting your nap. Sorry. <laughs> this beach is very clean, but maybe they had had some currents recently that have carried these bottles over here. I doubt that our friends in the Grand Sun community are littering in their own backyard. Um, it's just that, you know, it's probably hard for them to keep up and with the cleanup. But this beach was always clean, always, always clean. But everything is coming from the ocean. We we have had some rains recently and I could see all the garbage leaving Kingston and entering the harbor and I can imagine how the rest of the currents are bringing all that plastic into the sea. So that's why guys, this is a problem bigger than just doing a simple beach cleanup. We need to say no to plastics. We need to stop consuming plastics and maybe that way manufacturers Water companies realize that they can put water in a cardboard box, they can put water in, in biodegradable smaller plastic containers, or they can and, uh, or glass. They can just look for alternatives, you know. Oh boy. This is over there it's in a garbage pile, and it is up, it's a tooth proof um, metal braid line. The, it, people use this to to catch barracuda and, and and marlin and all those other um all those other fish that have sharp teeth and very strong jaws. For for uh, and they make this kind of product. This is metal and they use to they use it to to put hooks and make the fish get bited. And then when the fish bites it, it doesn't break at all. So we already made a video about this. And we may give you a clue if you've watched that video. If you watch that other episode, yeah. you can probably identify what type of rocks these are. Or this is, I don't know if it was just one you rock see? or more than one.
we really hope that you enjoy our beach day in Grand Stand Buffet. It is an amazing spot. We enjoy the experience with our friends here and all the different type of sceneries they have. We really hope that you can make it here one day and support this fishing community. It is just a different fishing experience. So until we see you again on the next escape. Bye! Bye. 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 Bye.